top bar hut, the uh, traditional hive, they stack boxes with mm -hmm. frames in them, and the bees will build the honeycomb on the frames, and then you stack the boxes, and that's how they um, produce their brood and store their honey um, mm -hmm. in uh, vertical boxes. And this is just, you place it on the side, and they, they will build their brood and their honey in the horizontal fashion instead. It's fairly new in the States, um, it, but it has been around for centuries. Um, this is a little bit less work um, than a traditional hive. It's more of a hobby for me, not a business. So it's just a little bit easier to work with and manage. Um, you, don't, <clears throat> you don't have to use chemicals. The bees are able to build the cells in the uh, wax to the size that they want to. In the traditional size boxes, the frames have a guide for the bees to build to the cell that man wants them to build. If, if you have a bigger cell, they can store more honey. So that's what the traditional type of beehive does, is uh, uh, have bigger cells so you can get more honey out of it. These are more of a natural, you let the bees build the wax and the cells that they want to build. Each hive can hold anywhere between 20,000 and 60,000 bees. The equipment and gear, you know, it's uh, about $300 um, to get a you know, beginner kit, uh, maybe a little bit more. Um, that's another reason I chose this is because I built these myself and for less than $40 a piece uh, you can build these things. Bees themselves you order um, through a company that you know, can supply you bees and you'll get a two pound box or a three pound box of bees and they'll ship them in the mail and you just go to the post office pick them up. Um, I'm also a gardener so I like to have you know, bees help pollinate the trees and our garden that we have. The different uh, pollen will affect the taste. So, you know, if a lot of farmers will have uh, beekeepers bring their hives to an apple orchard um, in the springtime, and then that will give you apple honey. Um, the same thing with oranges. Um, so you can get orange, you know, flavored honey. Um, so yeah, that, that affects everything, you know. A lot of what you see is clover honey in the stores. Mm -hmm. That's mostly, you know, clover field.